Hi there, it's M0 YKS and the family, and uh, we're out and about today. And uh, yeah, we're just uh, going to be climbing up up to the top of the summit. It's a place called Beacon Hill. So uh, I'll let's take a quick look. And that's where we're going to be going. I've got the uh, the two furry friends here, Finn and Fizz, and uh, they're going to lead the way. And uh, yeah, we've got quite a lot of lot of sheep about. <laughs> so yeah, we can communicate to the sheep, but it's an awesome view so far and we've not got anywhere near the top. Isn't that right? <laughs> yeah? Yep, yeah, certainly does. What do you say? Ba? <laughs> so yeah, we're going to make a, a move. I've got my hand held and uh, we'll head on up the top. Stopped off a few seconds just to get a bit of a, a look around. And see what's going on. We're getting there. <laughs> this vehicle is down at the bottom, so quite a long distance. And we're nearly there, and I'm getting cold, so back in a sec. Okay, so on the way. Quite well. I've got the uh, Kenwood TH7E 2 meter 77 handheld. I'll we'll try it shortly. Looks like there's a storm coming. Yeah, there's a storm coming that direction. Let's get going. <laughs> Maybe not. Yeah, we're, we're getting there. We're still not quite at the top, but uh, like I say, storm's coming in and uh, making good progress. My local area is in, uh, in that direction, over the hill, over the other hill, and uh, that's Ilkley. And uh, you can see the cloud, we're above the cloud, it's coming in nice, quite impressive. So yeah, we're just a little bit above it, I'm still not quite at the top of Beacon Hill in North Yorkshire. Yes, out and about. Hope you're enjoying the videos. I'm enjoying the exercise, not so sure. It's a bit of walking up, but you know, it's worth it. So hopefully when I get there, oh, that's not too bad. point up there and a, a bit of a walled up area from what I remember. It's been a few years since I've been up to this particular summit. A lot of water coming down. Down there. 
there it is guys that's the top there's the trig point sticking out I can just see the little white cap so I've got a little bit further to go it's uh, just up there and uh, yeah the weather's coming in here on Beacon Hill in North Yorkshire with M0 YKS in the family out and about Sunday afternoon and all is well so yeah I've got the handheld with me so I'm just going to get out the old pocket I've got the uh, Kenwood here we are so there's the transceiver hopefully you can see it put it on the calling channel and uh, see if we can hear anybody A signal coming from a repeater there, quite strong. Oh yeah, I'm just going to get to the top and then uh, probably got, put a couple of shout outs. Hopefully. That we've got, we've paid a lot of money for it. There's two dual seater settings and a, a buffy thing. So yeah, working okay so far. Um, Nearly there. Let's see what it's like when we get to the top. So yeah, there's the trick point. Finally made it to the top. Not taking too long, probably. I don't know, half an hour, 40 minutes walking. So on that line, but uh, worth the effort. So we're here now, up in the clouds. Just about with the gods. Thor and Odin. Hi, hi. So there we go. Welcome to Beamsley Beacon. The remains of two Bronze Age burial mounds and Napoleonic beacon. Moving stone to make modern cairns and shelters has damaged these important archaeological monuments. Around 4,500 years ago, a large stone mound was built here probably as a burial place of a local chieftain and to act as a territorial marker much of this cairn which is now about 11 meters in diameter still survives another smaller cairn lies further along the ridge at old pike so there you go guys quite an old 4500 year old cairn a fantastic place We made it, we sure did. <laughs> and here's the rest of my family getting up right now. So yeah, it's a cracking view. CQ2, CQ2 meters, Mike Zero, Yankee Kilo, Sierra Stroke Portable. M0 YKS portable on Beamsley Beacon, CQ2 and standing by. M0 YKS M7 BCE. M7 BCE, thanks for coming back. Do you want to try 550? Okie dokie. Shall we go up one? I think this frequency is in use. Try 575. quite my side, M7 BCE, M0 YKS stroke P on Beacon Hill near uh, North Yorkshire, just near Bolton Abbey, you're at end stopping signal. Name this side is Simon, over. I know your name, your surname is the same as my surname as well. <laughs> uh, my name's Daniel. I'm right at the very, very top of Fellas Road in Bradford, uh, so it probably will be quite, quite good. Back to you. Yeah, QSL Daniel, maybe I've seen you if you live in the bungalow, I've seen some antennas up there, if that's you. Yeah, lovely copy, you're full end stopping and uh, we've got a mixed bunch of weather, just missed it, well we just had a shower and now the sun's starting to come out, but uh, it's a lovely view from up here, I'm not sure if you know exactly where it is, it's just near Langbar, uh, just to the other side of Bolton Abbey there, Daniel Roger. Yeah, I know, I know exactly where you were, I used to live up there, well the first time it used to be, a few years ago now. Roger, a beautiful place, great place, I wish I lived up here, 
it's I haven't been up for quite a while good few years since I, I walked up but I've got the uh, kids the YL and the two dogs so I thought I'd bring the handheld and make a bit of noise at the same time but yeah great to copy you yeah. full end stopping signal Daniel uh, I don't think you can get any stronger over Thanks very much. It's a Kenwood TH F7, and I'm using an extension microphone, the Kenwood mic, just a little thing really, and, uh, and it's got a diamond, uh, that's a look, a diamond SRH771 antenna on it, and putting out five watts. Oh, that has gone off. <laughs> Not a battery power, guys. That's how it is. And it started to rain. Started to rain, so I'm just going to check my handheld out, and then we'll come back. So we'll just press stop on. That. So unfortunately, the battery power let me down on that one, but I had a bit of fun anyway, and. Uh, I'll make sure it's a bit better charging it next time I come up here. Not use it for a while. Did give it a quick charge, but obviously not good enough. But yeah, anyway, we've got a, a rainbow over here, so I'm just going to spin around and let this here lovely rainbow. So yeah, the, con the adventure continues and the sun's coming out. Things don't get much better. So Daniel, I do apologise for cutting the QSO short, my friend. And I'll catch you when I'm back down at the QTH, back in Bailden. You're a fantastic signal to the uh, top of Beacon Hill. So yeah, this has been fun and a uh, nice way to spend a few hours on a Sunday afternoon. Catch you soon. Hope you've enjoyed it. M0 YKS and the family on Beacon Hill Summit and not forgetting the two hounds as well. Catch you later. So yeah, catch you next time when I'm uh, fully charged. So yeah, good fun. Now we're on the